What's good, my people? Pretty nice view behind me, right? <laughs> me and my beau are here in the in the Hilton over in Washington, in D.C. Out for a little road trip. We uh, just came from uh, um, VA, checking out some historical sites, uh, Jamestown, um, Yorktown. Pretty interesting areas there. Uh, so we'll probably be hitting up a couple spots here in D.C. as well in the next few days. But anyway. Um, when I was in Jamestown, something occurred to me. It's a very, very great place to go check out. If you haven't been there, you should go check it out. A lot of histor historical info. You can brush up on your, your history there if you haven't been there. But anyway, uh, something occurred to me when being there, seeing how you knows the first uh, permanent English settlement that would later on become America here um, over in the West here. So it was, it was pretty cool to see that and see how uh, you had the Englishmen, you know, uh, people from all different cultures, black people, um, uh, Native Americans, and everything, working together just to make it work, man. And uh, it was it was real interesting. It could give you a lot, another perspective on it if you actually go and check it out. So I, I encourage everyone to go there. But um, something occurred to me when when we were there, and, it, and it's funny to me. And it just it just put another spin on how bad and how uh, harmful, you know, generalizing can be. When I say generalizing, I'm I'm speaking on, of course, when we talk about race in this sense, because not long ago, I heard someone make a comment, this black person making a comment towards someone who had whose background was primarily uh, Russian, and they were saying how that this person was racist just because of their skin color, because they were white, right? And when you go back and look at look at uh, uh, the trans transatlantic uh, slave trade, um, you can you can pretty much trace it back to individuals who were from Portugal. So I'm like, all right, this Russian dude, yeah, it's no probably has no Portuguese in his in his uh, background. If you probably ask him, but uh, he just made that broad statement, and it's like that's a sweeping general statement. And I was thinking a lot of individuals today make those general statements like he's racist well because he's white when you look at transatlantic slave trade his ancestors probably had nothing to do with that and we do that it's like we we go off people's ancestry or what we believe their ancestry is to pin someone okay but we don't even know we would have to make that statement work we would have to actually go back and trace the the, the ancestry back to individuals because you had people who who weren't even whose ancestors weren't even here during the time that the transatlantic slave trade was was taking place, they weren't even here. Their ancestors were, had nothing to do with it. But just because of their skin tone now, we would just pin them to having something to do with, with uh, owning black slaves. Not even the case. So when we make those broad, general, sweeping statements, we can be way off track and completely wrong for doing so. And anything after that, Standing on that basis of racism, anything after that is, is, is wrong because their ancestors had nothing to do with it. So who's going to take the time to say, OK, let me get the DNA uh, test done with this person before I accuse them and their ancestors of, of, of beating on my ancestors? Like, who's going to do that? Not many people. I don't think anyone's going to do that. So we just say that it's OK for just someone to say, oh, yeah, white people this and white people that and white people are wrong. And white people. But as I just said, to make a general sweeping statement like that, you could be completely wrong. So I just want to put this video out here real quick just to let people know, you know, individuals who do that or have found themselves doing it because, you know, even I, people in my family have done it. You know, maybe just, oh, the white man, him white, he white, 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 just because of his skin color. And you don't even know anything about his background. His ancestors probably may have never even had anything to do with the transatlantic slave trade. So it's, it's dangerous to make those general sweeping statements. You can destroy friendship, you can destroy families, you can destroy uh, uh, relationships, period, by doing that. So let's just be a little bit more conscious, people. That's all, that's all I want to say. Have a great day, and I'm going to have a great rest of my trip. Later.